Hi everyone, this is one of the easiest questions on the JE advanced exam. This came in 2021 and it can be done in just a matter of minutes. So let's begin by looking at the constraints. We have to find the area of this region and it's gotten these four constraints. So let's draw them. This is the first one. So X will be from 0 until 9 fourths. So we can draw that over here. Y will be from 0 to 1. So we can draw that right there. Then we've got X is greater than or equal to 3Y. So that's the same thing as this which would look so if we want to find what it looks like it'll have a slope of one third and it'll go here so when x is nine fourths y will be three fourths so it'll go like this okay and since y is less than it we're going to be concerned with this area now let's look at so we've done the first three constraints just the last one now that's the same thing as y is greater than or equal to two minus x two minus x so that would go from one one right here until this point which would be 2 comma 0 so it will look like that roughly like that and here we're concerned with this area so the top area so um, and this point here of course is 2 right so what are we looking at what's the final area that we need remember this this is basically like our boundary okay that's our boundary so it's going to be in this section and in this section so this is the final place. Okay, so you can just look at that like that. So we basically have to find the area of this. This is our answer. So how do we find that? That's the question. We could try to like break it up into triangles or we could consider this entire big triangle. So I'll just trace it once for you. This entire triangle and then subtract this triangle from that. Subtract that area from it. Okay, so let's try to do that. So what is the area of the big triangle? Well, this is three fourths. I shouldn't have written that. I should have written that earlier. So the area of this entire triangle and this length here is 9 fourths. So it's going to be 3 fourths times 9 fourths over 2, which is 27 over 32. Now we subtract the area of this one. How will we find that? Well, this part is not 9 fourths. This part is actually 2. That 9 fourths was for the entire base. So this part is just 2. Now what about the height over here? To find the height, well, we can just equate the two equations and find the y coordinate. So why we have this equation? We'll make it an equation. Right now it's an inequality. Same with this. So we can just do this. Set them equal to each other and find the y coordinate after that. So as soon as you set it equal, you get x equals 3 halves. I'm not going to show all the work here to, in the sake of time. So y equals half. So this point is going to be give, give us y equals 1 half. So what's the area of this? Base is 2. Height is half. So the area is going to be half. So minus half, which is minus 16 over 32. And this gives us our answer of 11 over 32. So we can go and box that and this will give you three marks in just a few minutes. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed.